Okay, inquiring minds want to know, why does one need a mask? <laughs> this is a funny question, but it's interesting to know that the mask is the number one impulse purchase in the skincare industry, hands down. And um, a mask is very powerful. In our world, our perfecting mask in the Cannabis Beauty Defined line has the highest amount of CBD in it versus all of the other products. Um, second is the serum. So when you're thinking about this, if people don't buy a bundle and they buy individual items, something to talk about is the mask and why, why do you need a mask? So after you've exfoliated and cleansed your skin, what opportunity do you have? You have an opportunity to do a deep clean. So think about the fact that sometimes we just vacuum the carpet or sweep the floor, but sometimes we actually have to remove and deep clean the tile or shampoo the carpets um, because we have a, a deeper need. Well, our skin needs the same thing. We have a lot of things that accumulate in our skin, um, and because we're using CBD, we don't have as much of it as um, some people do, but we still need a deep clean to get rid of all that debris and absorb what's not supposed to be there through the pores. So the fact that we have hemp and herbs and we even have green tea in our mask, among other amazing ingredients. This is a global mask for everyone. It's a clay-based mask. So when you use the mask, you take a little bit, your skin must be dry, so after you clean your face with the first two steps, um, pat it dry with a towel or a tissue, and then take the mask and apply it thinly over all surfaces of your skin, throat. Don't forget your throat and your decollete. It'll make a big difference. Um, avoid the eye area, so feel the bone around your eye. That's where you're going to stop with applying your mask all around the bone. Just leave a big circle around your eye. You don't need a mask there. That skin is a delicate tissue that's three times thinner and it doesn't have any oil glands, so there's no need to absorb <laughs> anything from around the eye area. Once you have the mask on, you leave it there until it's dry. If you leave it a little longer because you're being multitasking and then you're ready to remove it once it's dry. Once it's dry, it stops working because it's pulled and pulled and pulled and pulled and it's holding everything on the surface and now it's like, okay, remove me. <laughs> Once you are ready to remove it, you just take a washcloth and you dampen the washcloth with warm water, not hot, not cold. It needs to be warm. And then you can lay the washcloth on your face and press to loosen the mask and then gently start removing the mask in a circular outward and downward motion until it's all removed. Then you can follow with that little trick that I share with you before where you mix your serum and your moisturizer together and guess what? Those products are gonna absorb even better and more effectively and deeper than they would have if you hadn't prepared the skin this way. So at least once a week, try to do a mask and give your skin a new start. It's a lot of fun and it's a lot of fun to share this with people. So have a good time doing that.